Hello everyone. Let's do an experiment on air pressure. I have an empty bottle right over here and I have washed it because it was dirty and now I have placed it in the freezer. Let's wait for a few minutes and see the result. So it is 2 minutes already and let's see what has happened to our bottle. Okay. So the bottle we took out and saw that it is crumbled. So what crumbled the bottle in first place? Why it collapsed? Let's understand the science behind it. The bottle has regained its original shape. But now notice the surface of the bottle, the inner surface of the bottle. Can you see the tiny droplets of water? Yes. So my first question to you is, was the bottle really empty? The answer is no, because it had air inside it. It had air inside it. Now. When the bottle was outside, means it was like this, kept in normal way. The shape was not changed. It was normal as it is now. So, the pressure inside the bottle was normal. And the outside pressure was also normal. And they both balanced each other. And so, the shape did not change. It remained as it is. The normal pressure means the pressure inside the bottle was equal to the pressure outside the bottle. Okay. So, it had air inside it, right? And air exerts pressure in all ways. Sideways, upwards, downwards, in all possible ways. Now, air has molecules and these tiny particles or molecules are constantly colliding with the container inner surface of the container and also within themselves so this constant collision between the molecules and the vessel is taking place and this is the pressure the air pressure so air exerts pressure due to the collision of molecules of air so the pressure was normal we cooled it and then we get then we got low pressure now, when we cooled the air inside the bottle, actually, the air contracted. We know that air expands on heating and contracts on cooling. So, air condensed and it became more packed. It became packed. Okay. So, as you can see in the bottle that tiny droplets of water was also there. Why? Because the water vapor which was present in the air before that condensed to form water, liquidified gaseous state. So the gaseous form of water was liquidified under low pressure. Now when the molecules are closely packed, low pressure is created. And when low pressure is created, outside the pressure is normal pressure. But this normal pressure is higher than the pressure inside the bottle. So the bottle has low pressure and outside there we take it as high pressure. And we know that air moves from high pressure to low pressure. So the high pressure winds are hitting the bottle. They try to move towards the low pressure region and collapse it now if we remove the cap of the bottle then what will happen the air will come inside rush inside the high pressure air and the bottle will again regain its original shape and then the pressure will be balanced and it will be normal again so from this we can conclude that air exerts pressure and another formula that is pressure is inversely proportional to temperature that means when pressure increases it also increases the temperature so pressure is increased temperature is also increased now in this case the temperature was lower 
because it was cooled so pressure also became low as temperature was low pressure also became low and when it came outside it was outside was hotter than the bottle so there was high pressure and high pressure winds attacked the bottle and it collapsed the bottle so this was our air pressure experiment if you like the video please subscribe and leave a like thank you